American tourists found dead at Sanders Resort in the Bahamas. This one you cannot afford to miss. People, family, viewers, subscribe. We're going to come back to a brand new video. If you know the channel, feel free to subscribe, leave a comment, and like this video. Hope everybody have a great night today. People, this one you cannot afford to miss. Well, out of that part, let's jump into reports. NBC News have reported that the American man who was experiencing symptoms of the 19 virus was found dead at the Sandals Emerald Bay Resort in the Bahamas. The NBC said the man is believed to be in his 70s and no foul play is suspected. The spokeswoman of the Royalton Bahamas Police Force stated that preliminary investigation indicated the man has tested positive for the 19 virus and the autopsy is pending to determine the cause of death. So, the big money is 70 years old, left from the US, go all the way down the Bahamas. As so, I'm going to enjoy himself you now, to drink some juice, then at the sun, probably going to the pool, all about the sun. There's no sun that's big already. They, 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 they probably go all the way one day, probably night or day. They, they never end up wake up. They run them tests, them say 19 virus involved. But they don't do autopsy yet, so autopsy, when the report come back, then, then we know exactly cause of dead people. So, boy, oh boy, the man left from all the way in the US. Just enjoy the whole self, you know. But now, never end up to go back to the US alive, people. So, this one rough people. We have more reports, people. We want to continue to be safe on the road out there and the street is not easy. And pick yourself from the virus as well. Try to strong up the immune system. Do whatever it takes for you to have a stronger system, people. Because this thing is not an easy thing to get past, people. If you condition your mind and your body, because I'm going to enjoy himself in a busy but nothing look like. I know that happened, people. We have more reports. There has been a 35% plunge in public confidence in state of emergency as effective crime fighting tool a dramatic collapse of the feet from two years ago just over half of jamaica 33 percent describe a crackdown measure as effective in july rgr than and suppose 39 percent of residents disagree while eight percent were unsure so i want to say no people couple of them people are unsure unsure what I want, which is eight percent is unsure 39% are said this and I said that people. So right now, the people I'm confident plunge, it drop. People don't believe in a state emergency no more. They need a proper fighting method of crime. And this is all from the people's mouth. You know what I mean? So right now, people don't need more strategy. People have more reports. Residents of Gregory Park in St. Catherine are certain that since the fatal shooting of an alleged gangster who is said to have firebomb and house in the community, they are experiencing a ceasefire. So, after the gangster, you get fatally shot up, a beating, and go on. Firebomb after firebomb after firebomb, people. But maybe going to be safe on the road, people. Love one of the people. Stay off on the veranda. Stay out of the front of the yard. Stay come off of the road.